Good morning everyone. It's Monday morning already. Oh yes. Look at this. Friday. I'm ironing. Friday. Every Friday. Friday. Just for you. It's only, it's only Monday. You're just wishing it's Friday. Yeah. Yes, anyway, I am ironing again because I forgot to do my clothes last night, so I've got to get myself sorted. I don't know what's up with the dog, he's going crackers. Daddy, the fire is still going. Yes, don't worry about it, darling. It's not going to hurt you. Put it out. Yes, yes, that fire that was um, burning last night is still burning. And um, it, I've read on the news that, that that part of the road could be closed up until tonight. So There was a lot of um, straw bales set alight, though, a lot. So. Yes, the dog's oh, crazy as well. No, you don't need to see it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get this ironing done. Are you two going to get washed on that for me? Mm. Yeah? Lacey's still in bed. I must get her up in a moment or two. She's just gone. Well, it's just about 7 o'clock, isn't it? Ah, oh, little Lacey's gone now. She's tired still, aren't you? Good morning. The other two are dressed for me, aren't you? And I've got all my clothes ironed, so I'm going to have a cup of tea, and then I'll help you get dressed, yes? I'm going to help you get dressed, yes? Parrot. Parrot. It's just gone 8 o'clock, guys. I've got everything ready. All the girls' hairs are done. They've washed. They've had breakfast, brushed their teeth. But everywhere looks a mess in here. I don't know. It just looks messy. But then again, it's Monday. It's my Monday clean today. So, what are you doing? I thought you were playing upstairs. No, I think the kids want to play upstairs for a little while, but they haven't got long. Um, got under half an hour before I go, so I think I can watch a vlog. Yes, I think I can get in a vlog to watch before we go. In seven minutes, we will be leaving the house to take the kids to school. Oh yes, and I decided with only seven minutes to go to have another cup of tea. I don't know why, but I just fancied one. And I managed to watch a vlog, so, and that vlog being Mr. John Harrison's, and what an awesome vlog it was. Loads of good footage of Mikey there being a monkey. Cool stuff, I was so jealous, I wanted to have a go. Friday, right. Friday, 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 everyone loves a Friday. The mental, I wonder Friday. where they get it from. The John, that's, that's for you. you. Daddy, the fire's still going on. Yes, stop worrying about that fire, it's not, it's not near us, you're, you're fine. No, and where do they get the worrying from? I wonder. You. <laughs> right, it's time to go. Say goodbye, Liam. Cheese. Say goodbye, sir. Goodbye, everyone. Say goodbye, Lacey. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> We're back, and uh, well, as I come out of school, dropping the kids off. Rachel was there. She come to meet me. Bless her. I can hear an alarm. The kids keep setting alarms on their phones and stuff. I can hear it, but I don't know where it is. <laughs> Anyways, can't stop it, there we go. Time to ring my mum and then do the cleaning. Right, before I start cleaning, I thought I'd best ring the council and try and sort this ceiling out this week. And um, the person I spoke to said, well, they still haven't been out and sorted it. I was like, no. He went, oh, can I take your phone number and I'll call you back. So well, the next step is, though, um, spoke to lots of people, Mum and Bill and all that lot, and they've told us, which I've seen some of you guys put in the comments, that this time I'm not messing about. If they don't, if, you know, don't sort it this week, I'm telling them next time I speak to them, if it's not sorted, we're going to our local MP, because that's the only thing that I can think of to get their, uh, you know, bums into gear to get it done. So, I bet I just said to Rachel, I bet they won't even ring back. That's the kitchen floor all cleaned, bathroom clean. Oh yes, time for a cup of tea, um, got some stuff to do on the computer, still haven't heard from the council which I didn't think we would, and Rachel reckons she's going to do a bit of glossing at the top, as we're not decorating until after Christmas now, she's just going to freshen it up with some gloss and stuff, and I'm going to get this um, day day rail varnish soon, probably not today, but I'll wait until Rachel's done her bits anyway, otherwise we'll end up making a mess. Rachel's getting on well with her glossing, so you probably can't tell on camera, but she's just doing this door frame here, and it looks a lot whiter than it does down here, but you probably can't really tell on the camera, and she's, she's done all around there, so... Yeah, Bill's just turned up to take his lawnmower home. So I'm just wheeling that round to put in his car. And uh, we just had some manager come out from Kia 
look at the ceiling and uh, someone's coming to fix it today at last but I got mad with him because he started trying to give me lessons on asbestos and what's in the ceiling and I said look I'm not I'm not here to learn about what the ceiling is I said I want this fixing it's not good enough so hopefully it's been done this afternoon hi Bill hi Bill bye Bill hi Bill <laughs> quick visit bye Dad. Bye, bye. love you bye bye, bye. Doesn't it make you laugh? So since we've complained again today, they've got the boss out from the company, the building company, and they said that they'd be here later on to fix it. And all of a sudden, just like that, they're here. But tell you what, that bloke made me feel mad. Really, I said to Rachel, I said he made it made it sound like it was our fault, you know, and didn't sound pleased. He was like, when he went on the phone, he was like, oh, I'm here at the house. Like moaning about us as if to say, oh, you've been complaining too much. But what else can you do? This is the only way to get through to them, to get it done. I've just replied to my YouTube comments and that. I didn't have many to because I, I replied to quite a lot of them last night. Uh, obviously, these workmen here. I feel out of place, don't know what to do. I'm going to um, catch up on some more vlogs, I think. With everything that's gone on today, me and Rach haven't eaten. And um, I'm sort of going to be trying to watch what I eat again and that but I'm not going to say too much because I put too much pressure on myself but uh, I think I'm just going to have a salad sandwich and some brown bread oh yes the workmen have just popped out they've gone to get some more stuff or something some more mix or something he said but this is how they're getting on as you can see the hole's covered don't get me wrong that looks a mess but obviously it's not staying like that <laughs> I think I believe they cover it up with that again I'm not sure but um, yeah, at least it's coming along. I think he said it'll be finished tomorrow, so at least tomorrow I can get the bedroom sorted back to normal, put the girls back in here so Liam will be happy. And it just proves that the council and um, these builders' bosses don't really care about us because when you, the people that are doing this are really nice, they turn around and said, how long have you had to wait? And we said, well, like nearly a month ago when we rang up and first ever complained about the crack. And he said it was disgusting. He said, I can't believe that they've left you like that. So... There you are. I'm rushing down to school to pick the kids up. I've been stood in the room saying to Rach, oh, time's taking ages till uh, 10 to 3 to pick the kids up and um, the clock in the room stopped. I looked at my phone and it's 53 minutes past. I said, oh, best get a shift on. Oh, bless them. I hope I'm not late. I panic. Kids are home. Hiya, Soph. How are you? Alright, I wasn't late for any of them, in fact. Um, the twins were very late out. Uh, you alright? Yeah? And Liam's over there. Oh yeah. And there's Lacey. What's we tap? Yes, we've just been told that the workmen don't need to come back tomorrow now. It's going to be done today so they, the girls can go in their own bed, bedrooms tonight. <laughs> Don't we? And I keep forgetting, Rachel's got to go to work today, she's got another job, um, what she gets every so often for a week or so to do, and um, she's got that for a week, and she leaves, well, hang on, Sophie, and she leaves here about half four, but comes home for just after six, and the neighbour down the road finishes work at the same time, sort of, different places, but she's going to give her a lift home, so... Not too bad, so I'm afraid you got Daddy to sort your tea and that out. They have finished and they don't need to return tomorrow, so that's all good. So it's left like that, but he said after a couple of days you can paint that white. So that's what we will do. Are you happy to have your bedroom back? Yeah. Daddy, so Daddy. when Rachel go when Rachel goes to work and um, I've sorted the kids' tea out, I will come upstairs Daddy, and put their bedroom back fire. together. Are you still on about that fire? Yeah. Yeah, it's, fire. it's okay now. I forgot to mention as well, look at this. Hi. They've covered Liam's hole up for us as well, so we can paint over that as well. That's Which was nice of them. Was nice of them, wasn't it? So we've managed to get the bedroom sorted before Rach goes to work. There we are, looking loads better. Looks more like a bedroom now. Are you pleased to have your bedroom back safe? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, Time to sort their tea out. The kids have got their teas. They've got potato mishaps, which are just potato faces and stuff, and um, battered sausage and spaghetti, and they're enjoying that. And uh, normally when Rach does a shift, it always, everything seems a bit of a rush, but Rach has helped me tonight, and everything's gone smoothly, and 
I've got myself in a pickle today anyway with that ceiling and everything. I worry far too much, but I'm glad that ceiling's done. But yeah, so um, all I've got left to do, Rachel's going to get off in a minute now, and then all I've got to do is wash up and hoover up down here, and that's basically it. And hopefully Rachel won't be gone long, about an hour or so. so it won't be too bad. Bless her. Hey guys, six o'clock now. Rachel's on the way home with the neighbour, so I shall put the kettle on. And I've got to say, the kids have been good for me, so just been playing there. So, so said she's got a headache though, haven't you? It's time to take the kids to bed now. Oh, yes. And then me and Rach can sort something out for our tea. This is one of the other problems you see when Rach does this job. We always have our tea late, and obviously the later it gets, we can't be bothered to cook, so... I have no idea what we're going to have. Right, Lacey, good night. Good night. Is it nice to be back in your own bed? We'll be good. You're going to be good? Yeah. Good girl. No night then. Good girl. Love you. Good girl. Crazy. No night, sweetheart. Mm. Hopefully if you have a good night's sleep, your headache will go. Okay? Love you then. Love you. See you in the morning. I think Liam's nearly asleep. He said he was tired. Hello, boy Joe. No night, mate. Like oh, sorry. Kiss. No night. No night, Love you. It's so nice to have the girls back in their bedroom. Oh, yes. Although we've got Lacey playing up again. She's been playing up, really, since after school. She was good when Rach went to work uh, this evening. Um, but then as soon as Rach got home, she started again. I don't know. Kids, eh? So, I can see her playing up tonight, but... I need to find food. Yes, we do, Poppy Poo Poo. I don't know what to have. All I've had today is a... We didn't end up having a salad sandwich because the lettuce seemed to have gone funny. Um, we noticed that with the fruit and veg from Aldi's lately. It doesn't seem to stay fresh for long. So we had to chuck the lettuce. So we ended up just having a um, um, corned beef sandwich on brown bread. And that's all I've had today. So guys, we've decided we're going to have scrambled egg on toast and some of this lawn sausage for our tea, so something quick and easy. So I'm going to put that in the oven now. While that cooks away, I'm going to end the vlog there and start a bit of editing and uploading and good stuff. So I thank you guys for watching. Um, it's been a strange sort of day, but I'm really pleased with that ceiling's done. <sighs> but we'll see you tomorrow. Take care guys and peace out.